Okay. Here we are at what I think is going to be the start finish area. This flat section over here immediately to the left of the grandstands at the BMX course. Gravel parking lot area will be the, the pit area for everybody. Shops and that kind of stuff. Um, here we go. I'm going to start off. This is where the start finish line is going to be. We're on the crit course and there's just a tiny little bit of crit course this year. Coming around this corner, downhill, straight away, very fast. This will be a very fast section. Anybody on a geared bike is going to be in their hardest gear, pedaling, going, gosh, I don't even know, what, 30 miles an hour? I am currently cruising along to try to keep the wind down, going five miles an hour, riding my brakes. Very similar, this is where we turned off of the tarmac onto the race course last year. So obviously you want to be drifting to the outside edge left before you turn in to go right. And then unlike last year, now we're turning hard left. Riding the Scrabble Road over here before we're going to turn right into the Carhartt Mansion section. Lots of twisty single track. A little bit of mud. Lots of gravel. Gravel's definitely gonna get pushed around. We're already getting a pretty decent race line burned into the gravel through here little uphill section flat now we're headed straight at the river potentially tricky little right hand turn through here back up and around you see lots of fresh gravel through here so if you get off the race line you are instantly Slipping and sliding and spinning your rear tire. So it's going to be really important to stay on that race line unless you're passing. Oh boy, and I just did it there. Going up. Last year we came opposite direction through here, so now we're going up hill. Over a couple of little rollers. This area is going to be, man, if we get rain, this is just going to be sloppy mud. Slipping and sliding. We have a little left hand turn. A lot of this will look familiar to everybody who's raced before. However, we're going opposite direction. Now we're getting up here around the Carhartt Mansion. I like to go right over those rocks here are these sketchy little white rocks they kind of mess up your line pedal there's lots of fast gravel turns on this race course that you can sit and pedal through like this one and just try to choose a nice smooth fluid line and pedal as much as possible through all those sections. This is like the longest uphill. It's not really bad. It's not going to kill you. But it is uphill, this whole thing. And then it tricks you because here it gets much steeper. So using that whole climb back there to build up some momentum will make this much easier. Now, big, wide open, fast, flat, straight away. If you stand on the opposite end and look at it from about here down, is even a little bit downhill. 
so very fast lots of passing opportunity I'm thinking that the fast race line is going to be down the left hand side over here like this all the way down that road fast left over some gravel so I'm going to drift out to the outside edge hit the inside apex Now I really want to lean the bike over. This is a loose, weird turn. And now I'm pedaling. I want to be in the right gear, pedaling all the way up this hill. Fast. It's really not much of a climb if you maintain momentum and pedal all through that flat section. I told everybody I worked with today that you start pedaling, get back onto it before your momentum starts to go away. Here's this beautiful new berms and rollers, very fast. And pedaling through that last berm trying to hit the top third now we got a little tiny bit of uphill build up speed and momentum on this flat so it makes this little uphill punch kind of effortless and then another flat straight away it's even a little bit downhill this is gonna make that climb out a lot easier. If you use that to build up your momentum. Now we're pounding a straight line through the center of the parking lot. It's pretty loose gravel. Definitely takes some energy to get through this fast. Back to tarmac. Making a big sweeping right hand turn. I'm sure these posts will probably be gone for the race. Back onto the crit course. And that's one lap. 